So you're saying, Tom, you've got a pretty poor opinion of the military? Yes, I do. Unapologetically. I'm not saying it can't recover. I have about, I, the, I think of the military slightly higher. I mean, think about who's in charge of the military. Raytheon executive, Raytheon whore, Lloyd Austin, Mark Milley, white rage Mark Milley, uh, CENTCOM Commander McKenzie, all of which we played the video. You saw it. You had the Marine sniper at Abbey Gate ready to take action. Had the description, had the suspect, the Unabomber suspect in his sights, Asking, may I pull the trigger, please? We don't have that authority. Can you check to see? Let me check to see who has the authority. And when that person has the, uh, when that when that person tells me they have the authority, then he'll check to see if he has the authority. And that person will check to check on the authority of the authority over his authority. That's what that's our current state of the United States military. Twelve hours in advance. I'm not I'm not blaming the rank and file. I blame the rank and file in the FBI. I do not blame the rank and file in the military yet. But the rank and file is getting more and more corrupt inside the military also which we need to keep an eye on. But we had, the, we had it. We had the testimony. This guy has his arm blown off. I believe it, it may have been part of his leg blown off also, testifying before Congress. He had the guy in, in his sights, and nobody would, would pull the trigger. Lloyd Austin, Mark Milley, and McKenzie all knew 12 hours in advance that a unit bomber was coming to the Abbey Gate to blow up United States Marines, and they did absolutely nothing and now 13 of our soldiers are dead they're dead the democrats don't care rhino republicans don't care you got lindsey graham right now saying that we ought to launch missile strikes against russian against the russian air force what an idiot what a stupid idiot you know why because lindsey graham does never have to fight in any of these wars look i mean lindsey graham could not walk 10 feet let alone carry a backpack or carry a weapon or a fire weapon. Lindsey Graham can't do anything. So, of course, he wants other people to fight wars for him because it deepens his pockets. How did Lindsey Graham become a multi, 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 multi-millionaire? We, don't, we need to find out. Honestly, I don't know. But we need to find out how it is that a man that's making one to $300,000 a year becomes a multi, 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 multi-millionaire. Same with Nancy Pelosi, who's worth around $200 million and has never been paid more than $200,000 a year in her life. We need to find those things out, right?